Okay, so now we have our sketch ready and we're gonna start creating our resist with our crayons. Crayons, remember, resist the watercolor we're gonna use later. So we have our oranges, yellows, and greens. And I'm gonna start by taking a dark orange and outlining my koi fish. I'm not coloring it in. I'm just outlining all of my pencil lines of my fish with a dark orange. And these crayons will resist the water, meaning the watercolor will go right over top of them. And I'm gonna take my time. I'm pressing down firmly so that I get a nice, solid line of crayon. I'm also gonna add some black dots for the eyeballs with cray black crayon. And I'm also gonna add some yellow spots in all different shapes. They could be anything, really. I'm gonna take a little bit of black because koi fish are all different colors. Add some black spots on my other koi fish and continue with some more yellow because it'll resist the paint because we're gonna be painting these fish orange. And now I'm gonna go and outline my seaweed or my water plants but the water plants we're going to color in completely with green crayon you can use a bunch of different green colors or one green color but we're not going to be painting the green so we want the entire leaf to resist the watercolor and that's about it we'll finish coloring in all these leaves and we'll take a white crayon at the end and add some open circles, some bubble marks. We won't see them until after we use the watercolor. The watercolor will make the white bubble marks show up. And remember to press firmly with the crayon. All right, that's it.